Today it's all about the card tricks. We're going to talk about three routines. The first ace is up in a very nice sequence where the aces get lost in the deck in different places and instantly spring to the top. The second one is a logical conclusion, a handling of a plot by Larry Jennings. And finally, follow the leader, the classic that we all know and love, but a very uh, modern handling for this particular thing. And at the end, a little bonus item, a little finesse on the deliberate side steal. So I hope you enjoy the material here. Thank you very much. I happen to have a pack of playing cards with me, so if you'd like, we'll just try something with a deck. Well, not the entire deck. I'd like to start off with just a, a few of the cards, like these four aces here. And I want to be as fair as I possibly can throughout the entire thing. Now watch, very carefully, we're going to take the ace of hearts, and it goes right in the middle of the deck, right there. You can see where it goes, right in the middle, just like this. Uh, lost somewhere in the center of the pack. And next we'll try the ace of diamonds. It also goes right in the middle of the deck, just like that. I want to be as fair as I possibly can. You know absolutely where it is. Likewise, lost somewhere amongst all those other cards. Next, the ace of clubs. It too goes right in the middle of the deck. Now, I hope I'm not accidentally cutting some of these aces near the top or likewise uh, near the bottom. I don't want that to happen. I want all the aces to be lost at various places throughout the deck. And last, the ace of spades. Here we go. There's the ace of spades just like this. You can see where it is the entire step of the way, but wait. Just a snap of the fingers, a wave of the hand just like this. And that's how we end up right back where we started. Thank you very much. Yeah. <laughs>